Hey everybody, it's Dr. Craig here again. Today we're going to go in a bit of a different direction. I've been uh, sharing lots of things that you can do in the last couple of weeks uh, for movements and different ways that you can move your body. Today we're going to focus a little bit more on our mental health. And this is just a nice easy one to help to calm some of the anxiety, some of the um, challenge, the tension that builds up within our bodies. If you're having trouble sleeping, this is a fantastic way just to get your mind to calm. And it uses a little bit of biofeedback. It uses a bit of a um, kinesthetic sense so that you can start to really tap into your body. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to do a bit of a breathing exercise. And we're going to use and think of uh, your lung as having three different compartments. Okay, so when we're taking our breath in, we're going to fill up the top compartment, then the middle compartment, and then the third compartment, really trying to get depth into our breath so that we can start to bring uh, a big, deep breath into our bodies. Okay, so you can do this laying down, you can do it sitting up, you can do it standing, you can do it on the bus, you could do it wherever. All right, the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to take five deep breaths with our hands on our hearts. Okay, so just close your eyes, sit there quietly where you are. And we're going to take those deep breaths in through your nose, filling up that compartment one, then compartment two, then compartment three. Okay, so you're going to take a big breath in, so... Hold it for a second and then out through your mouth. We're going to do four more of those, okay? So just think filling up that first compartment, then the second compartment, then the third, okay? Here we go. Really concentrate on the cold air going in through your nose and the warm air coming out of your mouth. One more. Now we're just going to move our hands over top of our stomach. So just below your rib cage there. Okay, so five more deep breaths here. Here we go. Again, keep thinking about those three compartments. In through your nose, out through your mouth. Okay, so now we're going to move our hands right down over top of our belly buttons. Five deep breaths. Here we go. In this position, you really want to feel that lower abdomen lift as you take that breath in. Cool air going in through your nose, out through your mouth, warm air coming out of your mouth. Now we're going to move our hands back to our stomach. So that second position. Again, big breath in through your nose. Really feel the lift of your body as you take that breath in.
and back to your heart over top of your chest. Big breath in. For two. Last one. Awesome. Good job. Notice how much more relaxed your body feels. Our breathing is such an important tool that we can use to really start to maximize oxygenation in our tissues, but really start to calm and relax the nervous system. Your sympathetic, your, your, your calm and relaxed portion of your nervous system is the brakes. It's the part that slows your body down and slows that nervous system down. When we're socially isolated, when we're not getting the right diet, when we're not getting the right activity, we're not getting outside, that all starts to cause our bodies to go more towards that fight or flight stress response. And so this is a great little exercise just to help you to relax, help to get your nervous system to calm and then you can get on with your day and get back to bed, get back to sleep, whatever. So if you're an insomniac or somebody that just has trouble sleeping, this is a great opportunity for you to do it. You may even wanna to try to do it 10 breaths in each position just because you're really gonna to start to get the meditative response of it. I hope this helped. Uh, take a minute if you have, just let me know how it's working for you. I'd love to hear from you. I'm getting so many great emails. Thank you so much for everybody for the support. I hope you're all doing well. Can't wait to see you next time.